Young Philly and Harry Panera get crazy. Bit of a and also no kids mom from Google UK. Okay? But I mean it's the year in search apparently, so let's see how it works. Twenty two people. Can I be honest with you that I'm not your friend in this round? I believe that um, it's taken over the world. A little bit, no, Number one, it's, it just makes sense why it's the number one search. Brother. Brother, I don't know. No, I no, got no, it no. wrong. No, Can no, we no. move this question? I want to help you so, so you understand, though, innit? Hi, everyone. I'm Philly. And I'm Harry Panero. And we are here with Google UK, taking a deep dive into what the UK has been searching for this year and some of the top trending Google searches. Yes, we're both incredibly competitive and we're going to be putting each other to the test in a quick fire quiz. So, Harry, with that being said, let's get into it. Topic one is Star Sign Calculator. Now, Star Sign Calculator hit a decade high search in 2022 in the UK. Now, why did you just say? I can say, yeah, almost 95% of the last girls that I've dated asked what sign I am before we even get to know each other. I, I believe that um, it's taken over the world. A little bit, number, number one, it? it just makes sense why it's the number one search. Um, oh all right. When is Mercury next expected to be in retrograde? What the heck is that? What does that even mean? What does Mer what? How about this? Oh, Alright, Google okay. search to find etrogate. What was that word? <laughs> ah, <hold on. laughs> right, let's see the To find Mercury in retrograde. Ah, Mercury is in the retrograde when it appears to be in a backwards in its orbit. Ah, uh, this optical illusion occurs maybe uh, multiple times a year. Uh, it takes just 88 days ah. uh, for Mercury to circle the sun compared to the Earth's 365. Okay. Okay. This is almost, this is also the fifth day of Christmas, yeah? And it's a period of time. Brother. Brother, I don't know. No, no, I got no, no, it no. wrong. No, no, Can no, we no. move this question? I want to help you so, so you understand, though, innit? I said it's five days. Brother, I, at okay. this point, I don't cool. care about the answer to this one. It's winding it's from up. from December the 29th to January the 18th. It's from December the 29th to January the 18th. Yeah. All right, cool. Good one. But at least you know what retrograde is. Yeah, yeah I do. I actually learned a new word today. Yeah. Retrograde. All right, so the next topic is women's football. All right. Now, searches yeah. for women's football reached a record high in the UK in 2022. Can we give a yes. massive round of applause for the Lioness? Yeah. How many nations took part in Women's Euros 2022? Well, if you think about the fact of the matter, which is, it could be anything from 20 to 30. <laughs> now, it's just oh, about defining, it's about defining that it's either 24 or 32. 32. Take away. <laughs> take away six. And if you take away six, sometimes you get the answer. And it's about... <laughs> it's still wrong. The answer is 16. Ah, but I was close-ish. Yeah, he was. Yeah, yeah, a bit. All right, Phils, yep. um, we've got a, another topic, okay. and this topic is crochet. I feel like before we even get into these next questions, we should find out what crochet is. Hey, Google, define crochet. Okay, crochet is a process of creating textiles by using a crochet hook to interlock loops of yarn, thread, or strands of other materials. Can you guess what these popular crochet items are while blindfolded? Oh, this is nice. And make sure you can't see nothing. No, yeah. well, this is comfortable. All right, so put your hands in this, Phils. Yep. There's a bag. Yep. And you tell me what um, what crochet items these are. So basically, uh, all right, yes. boom, I know exactly what this is. What's that? Oh, I don't know. And what's it feeling like? T talk to me. Give um, me some explanations. Like the, 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 the first second I grabbed that, I thought, oh, they're little, so like little kids' gloves, but it's definitely not that. Is it, okay, can you give me a clue? Is it a piece of clothing or is it like, for example, a toaster that's just been made out of knit? <laughs> what? It's not clothing, it's an item. No, no, it's an item, yeah, okay, yeah. Cool. Scariest time of the year, though, Phil. Scariest, so. pumpkin. Wow. Well done. Exactly. Well I'm taking my blindfold. That was a good one, innit? But he, the clue was too easy. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Should right. Just hold it here quick, hold it, hold it like that, just so the camera can see. Yeah, yeah. okay. Are these legs? I don't know. All right, no clues on that. Um, Do you want one? like an octopus. You... Nah. I, I, are you sure? The thing is, the reason why I'm no, saying that... No, are you that, sure though? I'm, I'm sure because I'm thinking yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> Brother, you're right, you're right. You're All right, right thank you right, so right, much, you're man. You're right. Let me have a look at them. You're right. Yeah, octopus. Okay. 
So, Philly, this is round two, and this is the anagram challenge. Google have set us an anagram challenge to unscramble some of the top trending things the UK has been searching for this year. Now, it's our job to try and figure out what they are. Oh, I like this. Good okay. game. Okay, Google. Uh, could you set a timer for 30 seconds, please? All right, 30 Eight, seconds. Starting now. Now, this is a nickname of a sports team. Oh. Who brought it home this year for England? But that kind of looks like a word already, though. Sisonelli. Sisonelli. Uh, how would you use that in a sentence? Um, so. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> so, 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 no, so we right, have 10 seconds left. Uh, can I have a clue? I, I just said it to you. No. This is the nickname of a sports team that just brought it home this year for England. Who's that then? You see the top? Oh my god, no! No! I'm done, it's no! Oh my god! I'm fuming, I'm fuming! The lionesses! Yes, the lionesses! Oh, I'm fuming! The lionesses! I'm, yeah. I'm just panicking, because you're right, that, that clue was perfect. It was bro. sensational. You could have yeah. not made it any easier for me. I know, I do. <laughs> okay, Google. Yes. Set a timer of 30 seconds. All right, 30 seconds. And that's starting now. Do I get a clue? Do you need one already? Yeah, yes, please. Uh, this comes from a tree. You mix it with water, and it's and it's a top trending drink recipe in the UK this year. <laughs> oh, elderflower. Oh. Elderflower. Dial rock. <laughs> Cord oh, cordial elderflower. Elderflower cordial. Ah, oh, you're so. What, dial rock. That's the rock. That's here. right, bro. You got it right. Oh, is it? Yeah. Look. Can you ask? <laughs> Come on. Cord that sounds so perfect. Oh, no. I know things. You see, with me, I like to put words together <laughs> properly. That's why I made a career. I've been shook. Okay, Google. stop. Do you know I actually spoke to that house, speak to my son sometimes, you know? Yeah. Google stop. <laughs> <laughs>so this one is round three this is the local legend challenge uh, it's time to harmonize for the hum off of the year in this challenge we'll find out who is the humming champion binley mega chippy was a trending restaurant in the uk this year our task is to hum the binley mega chippy song whoever gets the highest percentage accuracy on google's hum to search wins okay i'm gonna go first okay i just feel like it's just to show you how it's done kind of thing isn't it can, mm -hmm. I, can, I, can I go first <laughs> Okay. 29%. Yeah, there you go. I'll take that. <laughs> Alright, you take that? Yeah. Oh, I think I got this, you know. Go on. Right. One. Twenty-nine percent. Twenty-nine percent, bro! Twenty-nine percent! We gotta go one more. We have what to go you, one more. We're not get? 29. We're not ending it on a oh, draw. God. Let's go again. One more. Oh my god. Let me go. Let me go. Oh my god, 29 again. 29. So this is make or break now. Yeah. We need to get more than 29. Let's right. go, let's go, let's go. I would like to say, Young Philly is the winner of this round. What did you get? I got twenty percent. Oh, flipping awesome. But that humming, I'll be honest with you, yeah, I, I was losing, I was losing breath. Yeah, it's, it's right, humming, humming's a difficult task. Hey. All right, Philly, this is round four, and it is called Searching Near Me. So it's basically, can we guess what has been searched out of each of these locations? Now, the first question is, Felipe, Merhead in Scotland was one of the top places in the UK searching for which type of ice-based sport this year? The first sport I think of is ice hockey. Yeah, you didn't give me a reaction, so it's not that. It could be. Is ice skating a sport? Yes, it is. So is that your final answer? No. It's yeah, no, it's evil. It's, it's so evil. One of those two. Yeah, and I feel like Google is going to teach me something new, and there's going to be some next sport. But I'm just going to go for. All right, cool. Let's just go ice hockey then. Yeah, it's yeah. actually ice skating. Oh, fuming! It's actually ice skating. That's brother. so annoying. But yeah. I'm, I'm happy with like my, 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 my guess anyway. Even okay, cool. I didn't get right. Go on, you give me one. Then. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, come on, man. <laughs> I'm not trying. To okay, can I be honest with you that yeah. I'm not your friend in this round? Okay, cool. Just so you know, this year Stanmore in London was one of the top places in the UK searching for which type of business in which you eat food usually at mealtimes? Restaurants. What? This is a setup. What is, is it? Wait, hold restaurants. on, hold on. So at mealtime, you yeah, know this. Listen to the question. Mealtime, meal there's breakfast, lunch, mm -hmm. 
and dinner. Yeah. All of those places are in one establishment, right. which is cool. Not all the times, because certain restaurants only do... Takeaway. Takeaway! It's so mad, bro. I literally just said the answer. Takeaway? <laughs> no. Yeah, that, that, that's my it. final answer, takeaway. Because right, cool. the question, where you've... You're, you're going to be question. human because you actually said the answer the first time. Oh, you literally just done what I did. What answer? breakfast? Restaurants. But I said Wait, restaurants. Man. Why, you, brother? Yeah, yeah. You're, you're trying to do something here, which is making me look silly in front of my son. He's watching. So what, do you, <laughs> what do you have to say to my son now? <laughs> Kimi, love you. Okay. Love you. Daddy's a good daddy? Daddy's a good daddy. So that is the end of the round. As you can see, me and Harry Pinero failed miserably. Miserably. Um, let's just hope we do better in the next one. All right, Phils, this is the final round. It's called Identify the Imposter. In front of us are some of the top trending food and drink recipes this year. Mm -hmm. Two are true trends and uh, one is fake. Our task is to identify the fake by removing it with a magic eraser. And you have two clues to help you. This is question one, all right? Which is not among the top trending savoury food recipes in the UK this year? All right, so clue number one. There is a national day dedicated to this food in August every year. In this country? In the UK. That is not. We ain't got no burger or potato or ramen day. <laughs> Clue number two. Among other things, this can be made with beef, chicken, lamb, vegetables, and soy. Do you know right, what let, let me just take yeah, the picture. Yeah, take a picture and erase what you feel like isn't a trend. The nice little angle. Yeah. That's the proud parent angle. Little feature that little camera has. What? It tells you like the balance. Oh, so Bro, that's, that's cold, that's so it's good. always, that's you get good. me? That's very good. Okay, now, as I break... I told you like the balance. Oh, sorry. Bro, that's, yeah, that's cold, that's so it's good. always, that's you get good. me? That's very good. Okay, now, as I break down my answer, the second clue threw me off a little bit, and yeah. it was only one thing that threw me off in it, because I'm convinced this mash, mm -hmm. mash goes with all those meats that you said, it goes yes. with vegetables, mm -hmm. however you meant, you said soy, yeah. and I'm pretty sure that's soy sauce. I know when I make noodles, I definitely slap some soy sauce in there. Philly, remember, you're only removing one, and two will remain. I've actually got rid of the burger, you know. That's your final decision, yeah? I like to announce. No, I know you too well. I'm not right. Mm -hmm. I like to you. Is that actually a burger? It's on your son's life? My son's alive. Woof! Done. Yeah, done. Got that right then. Yes. See how we lock in the marks? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, when yeah. you know your bread is not lying. You either use the kids or the mum. Well done, well done, well done, well done, yeah, well done. Yeah. Well done. You got that right. You've done your thing. Yeah. Yeah, no. How do you feel about that? Good. All right, Harry, you're up next. Which is not among the top trending drink recipes in the UK this year? Okay, based on studies, I would think that I feel like hot chocolate is very trending. Yeah. yeah. I mm, would I go like with strawberry for some reason. Okay. All right, well, I'm going to try and edit this now. Okay, go to tools, magic eraser. Okay, give it some time. Circle it, get it out, and it's gone. Okay, <laughs> it's so actually gone. show the people at home what you have got rid of. Um, I have got rid of the strawberry smoothie. Now, guys, once that has been removed from the picture, that means his answer is locked in. Yes. Harry Panera, drum roll, please. I can confirm that the correct answer is hot chocolate. Why would you? Why would you do that to me, bro? Yeah. No, but I'm with you. What would you have picked? Like one of the, the smoothies too, for sure. I do love a hot chocolate. Yeah, because right? I love I, it. I love a hot drink. Comment right. your favourite hot drink down below. And that is the end of the video. But before we let you guys go, we need to reveal the winner. Oh. And I can confirm. What do you think? Because because you've said that, and based on your performance, I feel like you've won. You'd be surprised, brother, because it has ended in a draw. I, can, can I be honest? No, oh, oh, yeah. Thank you so much. You, you know, know what? what? I'm so happy yes. with the draw. I'll and, be honest. And we've bonded. But with that being said, yeah. make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell. So what? You are not fine when a new video is out. And also, I'd just like yeah. to say with all our hearts, Google UK. No, we absolutely love, love you. you. Guys, take care. Thank you for watching. No, no, no. Video, video. Enjoy it. Video. 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 Video.